Hey friends, it's Candace again. I'm about halfway through, I think. No, more than halfway through. I've got four. Yeah, I am halfway through. So this is um, my March card buffet. It was supposed to be a live event at my in-home studio to be socially responsible and help combat this COVID-19 scare. I decided I'm going to try and move it online. So here we go. Okay. I have five other videos so far. This is my sixth one. Um, and I think you're going to love this card. But just to remind you, you can get four cards and all ten PDF card four card kits and all ten PDFs with measurements sent to you. Um, the PDFs will be emailed to you. Um, if you do twenty dollars or if you do a $25 or more order using this host code before March 31st, I will also send you your four cards of choice plus 10 cards, 10 PDFs with measurements. So let me know if you have any questions on that, okay? Um, quantities are limited, and I will tell you I only have about four more of the Timeless Tropical cards. So anyways, isn't this card so stinking cute? And I didn't even color it. I really want to, though, um, but I want it for the sake of time, um, and some people don't like to color, so it's just as effective, but look at these darling little ladybugs down here. I decorated the envelope with them, too, and this was made using, I just had it, the little ladybug set. This is a free celebration host set. So, if you want to collect orders from your friends, um, let me know. And I, if they are all over the country, that is fine. But if they are all over the world, I'm sorry, but out of country, out of the outside of the U.S., um, they will not be able to contribute to your party. But if you host a party or put place an order of three hundred dollars or more, um, you can get this stamp set for free. And look at all of the images you have. The cute cutest little ladybugs and the cutest little sentiments for birthdays thank yous thinking of you um, just to say hi encouragement spread spread your wings and fly like who would not love a card made with this um so far i do i have one extra one that i think anybody who orders this month with that host code will be in entered into a drawing um to win my extra one okay so it has a bunch of stamp sets, but I told you guys, um, well, I had mentioned it earlier. I want to do these cards with other stamp sets. So we're going to use a timeless tropical because this is one of my favorites from the mini catalog and it is so versatile and has so many sentiments and images. And of course it um, reminds me of my island home of Kauai, which is they are on lockdown right now. They have a stay-at-home order until April 30th. So we've been, my kids have been having fun video, video calling them. Thank goodness for technology, right? We can also stamp together using technology. So that's another plus side. Um, wildly happy, I just checked and these images, they certainly will fit inside of these little blocks. Okay. Um, to a wild rose, I did not check this, but I'm sure partials of them <laughs> will fit in there. Okay. Um, wish for it all. This would work as well. I just, you guys, positive thoughts. This is in our mini catalog, another favorite of mine. I'm just trying to show you stamp sets that have lots of images as well as, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Sentiments. Okay. Because they're so versatile. Okay, so again, for this demonstration, our sample card used a little ladybug, but I'm going to use this Timeless Tropical. So let's get started. Your kit will come with this pre-tied, and you can take it off if you don't want it there, which is perfectly fine. I just, a lot of my friends, my stamping friends, do not like tying bows, and so I just do it for you out of the kindness of my heart because I hate seeing you guys struggle. Okay, so anytime you need a bow tie, let me know. <laughs> if you're at class anyway. But all of the bows that I use for my card buffet will be um will be pre-tied for you. 
you're welcome. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to use this big hibiscus image, a leaf. Excuse me while I keep these from toppling over. I'm using one ink pad, the Memento ink pad, because if you want to color um, using blends, you need to use your Memento ink pad. Okay, um, thank you, and a leaf. All right, so the first thing I want to do is stamp the outside of my car or my envelope. Okay. And you could use any images, but I think you could tell that's a flower, right? I don't want to take up too much of the envelope. Okay, there's our envelope. And then I'll stamp the inside of my card with this hibiscus image in the corner. Okay. And then we'll get to putting our card together. So the first thing you want to do is take your yellow mat and you want to arrange where you're going to put your pieces of paper just so that they have good spacing in between with them. Okay, it's kind of good to eyeball what your layout is gonna look like, so that's mine, okay? And I'm gonna do my hibiscus again. You could use palm trees, you could use plumerias, you can, if you have the little ladybug set or win it, um, you can certainly use that too. But look at the detail of these images. I think that's another reason why I really love this stamp set is because of how detailed it is. Like you don't even need to color that. And I'll put my leaf there. Notice I'm putting them right back where I want them so that they don't get turned around. And then we're gonna do a thank you. This stamp set I might wanna mention also has coordinating dies. And um, so there's one that cuts out palm trees, all of the images in there it cuts out, and then it has like a big huge pineapple that I'm making thank you cards with. All right, how did I put this together? I just used good old Tombow glue, okay? So just a little bit goes a long way, and I like this because the liquid glue gives you some wiggle room, especially when you're trying to line things up. If you're one of those People who like to have things in a particular way gives you a lot of wiggle room, the liquid glue does. And if you want them collagey and and just kind of wherever on this paper, that's fine too, right? Okay, then that looks a little plain. So I am going to put some can I put on here? Some palm trees or pineapples. Let's do pineapples because I love pineapples. Okay, so get my pineapple on my block here. Kind of like my ladybugs. I'm gonna just randomly stamp them over here. Okay, and I can scooch this up. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> okay, so there's my pineapple, sorry. Okay, there we go. Isn't that cute? So here's my matching envelope. I guess I could have put pineapples instead. My matching envelope, and I'm again, I used for this card, I use a Timeless Tropical. This is in our mini catalog. And then this is our original card with our cute little ladybugs using the little ladybug host set. So let me know if you want to get a party together. You would have to get orders in the next few days to meet the March 31st deadline. But thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoy this. Again, I'm going to put this out here. How to get these card kits that I'm making. Either send me a message and tell me which cards you want. I will send you an invoice for $20. You'll get 10 
PDFs with measurements um, for all 10 cards and choose four designs that you want to be sent to you. Or instead of the $20 PayPal, you can put a $25 order using this host set, I mean host set, host code at stampinup.com. Um, and I will, once you use that code, it will give me credit and send me a message that you ordered and I will get your uh, goodies in the mail. So have a great day, guys, and thanks so much for joining me.